Connor Kiernan, Clarendon Gales. From his youth playing days in the Gales organization to now the leading scorer on his major series lacrosse team, it's been a rewarding journey for Connor Kiernan. His second season with Brooklyn saw him emerge as a top offensive threat after a handful of big stars departed before the season began. Yeah, for sure. Uh, obviously, losing some of those uh, five of our key guys last year, it's, uh, it's a tough blow. And, uh, you know, they're on doing good things too. And they'll be back hopefully in the future. And uh, it's nice though for myself and a couple of the younger guys to get more reps and, you know, do new rules that they weren't necessarily doing last year. So this year I'm carrying the ball a little bit more. So I get to work on that asset or uh, aspect of my game a little bit more. Uh, so honestly, it's, it's, it's great being able to round out our game. And then it also just helps out the team for future when we have a young core like we do this year and they get a bunch of experience this year. Uh, it's only going to be uh, positive going forward. Like many others in the Brooklyn organization, Kiernan cut his teeth playing in the region. His Gales days led to a bright junior A career with the Whitby Warriors in the summer months where he captained the team in 2017. He played the field game with Canisius College, earning his conference's top offensive player award and tournament MVP in 2018. All those roads led home to Brooklyn. Uh, so I grew up coming here for qualifiers, provincials. It's always been my kind of like my home rink. So it's nice to be able to play here throughout my junior career and then also be protected in my senior career. I'm very fortunate. It's a very storied uh, franchise. Inside feet, Kiernan scores! Kiernan gets his first to the NLL. A season in the pros with San Diego helped set him up for success this past summer. While his role with the Seals will be different once the National Lacrosse League resumes, this experience with Brooklyn will help him in his sophomore season in the Sun. I was more so of an off-ball guy in San Diego, and so I didn't carry the ball much. So this year is going to help me for coming up to my next NLL season is I'll be more comfortable with the ball, playing against bigger defense and uh, better defenders.